Hi, I'm Karen Heinecker from Walton Charity. We started this community allotment project five years ago, which was to help anyone and everyone in the local community come down for free and engage in growing and enjoying the mental, physical, and emotional benefits of it. And now we are so excited. The piece de resistance, we're going to actually have our own greenhouse and a shed, which will enable us to just do so much more than we really think. Kingston and for, for partnering and bringing these enthusiastic students to do this. We're interested in how these seemingly simple structures could somehow have a symbiotic relationship, creating an autonomous world and microclimate within themselves, not similar to many of the allotment plots that make up the site. What we wanted to offer the students was a view into the particular conditions of allotment sites and their close-knit communities, focusing on communal work to achieve something for the benefit of others, while also underlining that architecture is not a matter of scale in relation to its desired purpose. I am a master's student, I'm actually studying philosophy, so something very different from this. I met some interesting people. There's like three students and six formers, five grads, and but everyone's here because they like the same things. I'm Elsa. I've just been doing the um, Kingston Foundation on the 3D specialism, um, and I thought that this project would be a really good opportunity before I then go on to do something more like wordy. I'm doing English next year to get involved in like a build again, like work collaboratively with people. It's got like basic skills like drilling, sawing, yeah. like screwing, which will probably will help me in the future and something you can't really take away from me. Yeah. I also know how to do more like DIY stuff for the future, which would be helpful. I'm doing graphic design degree at the moment, so I thought this would be really interesting to up my skills in terms of design, different spheres of design would be really great, and also to see things actually in action, not just on screen. There really is no eye in teamwork. This genuinely couldn't have happened with only one person. Like Everyone's so brilliant here, it's just really good to be surrounded by all these different talent and all these different people studying all these different subjects. I'm in year... 12, going into year 13. Um, the reason I did this project would be good because I want to do architecture in the future and I thought it would be like a good experience to talk with architects, talk with students as well. Um, I've talked to several different students from doing interior design, doing architecture and even doing some doing fine art or even foundation courses at Kingston. So I thought it was, it's really interesting to see like different experiences. It's interesting to see how Jamie and Lorenzo designed the shed slash greenhouse and yeah. I've learned that like everybody can have a part to play in making a, a change in people's lives. I've always wanted an allotment. It's a really nice place. You can feel the community. It's exciting. Also how much food is actually grown here. It's crazy. I'd really like almost like a vineyard, so I'd like to grow lots of grapes. Pink blueberries, I think, and fresh fruit, fresh frozen fruit, fresh veg. I'd love to do more things like this now, especially in like outdoors, green spaces. I think that's what makes it so fun. <laughs> Something massive that you can't you can't um, grow in a flat like. Artichokes, something like that. My own allotment. Well, over there, there is a Bengali hodugas. Well, that's what we call it in Banga. It's a squash plant and it's related to my culture, so I guess I'd plant that, something like that. Make my grandma proud. Yeah. <laughs>